Hi everybody. Today we worked on the relationship of ratios and rates and that rates are special ratios that compare two different units of measure. Um, time is a unit of measure that's often used in rates and we're going to just do a quick problem so you can understand and recap what we did in class today. Angela enjoys swimming and often swims at a steady pace to burn calories. At this pace, Angela can swim 1,700 meters in 40 minutes. What is Angela's unit rate? Now, if you remember, unit rate means per one. So we have to figure out what we're working with. And letter B says, what is a rate unit? Rate unit is just another way to say, what are the labels of the rates that we're comparing? So in this case, we are comparing meters to minutes. So our rate unit would be meters to minutes. So if I know it's meters to minutes, I'm going to go ahead and set up the information that they gave us. 1,700 meters to 40 minutes. To find the unit rate, it means per one. So we want to get per one minute. In order to get per one minute, the directions that we were given in class, so what will work every single time, is if you take the top part, your 1,700 meters, and divide it by the second part of your rate, your 40 minutes. So it's the same as saying, look, we're going to make an equivalent ratio. 40 divided by 40 is 1. 1,700 divided by 40 will give us our missing number that we need here. So let's go ahead and work out that problem. 1,700, if I divide it by 40, first of all, I can see that I can do a divide by 10 ahead of time to get rid of some of these zeros so that I don't have to see it anymore. 40 divided by 10 is just 4. 1,700 divided by 10 would just be 170. I've simplified the problem with a little number sense. Now we can just divide. How many 4s are there in 17? Well, 4 times 4 is 16 with one left over, which is smaller than 4. So I can bring down the next digit, which is a 0. Now we're looking at how many sets of 4 can I get out of 10. So I know that 4 times 2 is 8 and I have 2 remaining. So I have 2 left over. So I know I've got 42 and 2 out of 4 or 42 and 1 half meters. So to find your unit rate, you compare it to 1. To get the unit rate, you take the top portion of your rate, 1,700, and divide it by 40, the bottom part of your rate. 1,700 divided by 40 gives you 42 and a half to 1 minute. There's how to find unit rate and what it means. You make sure that you keep them labeled so that you can answer the question. And good luck with your practice tonight.